Saturday. Right, I've done the ultimate mistake. I've put the wrong lids on my bottles and they're solid. So whenever I finish my, my resins, I never ever chuck the bottles away. So I've got a load of little tiny bits and pieces. Now, two minutes. Okay, now this one I've had to put in a little warm bath because it was solid. Right, this is my old bottle. What I've done is I've cut the top off of this one. So I basically hacked it. <laughs> it's probably not the wrong bottle because I've done a couple already. And I thought I might as well show you what I'm doing. So I've basically just cut them in half. Or in my words, hacked it. And I'll get my bottle. And this is going to be awkward, but as you can see, there's resin left in there. And it was solidified at the bottom. See, look. So what I'm going to do is manoeuvre that to go in the hole. And that bit. And this is all my old bottles. And I've got enough here. See that it's all come off the bottom. I'm doing this really awkwardly. <laughs> it's all come off the bottom. It's gone in there. That's rubbish. And look how much resin I've got I've saved so far now they're the bottles that were good uh, sorry old <laughs> now this one is my good one and as you can see I got quite a bit left in it and I cannot for the life of me get that off I cannot get it off I've used my heat gun and I've burnt my hands trying to get it off. It will not come off. So all I'm going to do is yet again, cut it off, put it in that one. They are all Vista Cascade. I am not mixing resin brands up. I am not mis mixing any of the actual resins itself up. So they are all Vista Cascade. These are all A's. And I've got two little ones of B and the one I've actually put the wrong lid on. So, this is all I'm doing, literally. Getting an old kitchen knife, cut it in. That's the easiest pie. Slice it well. And as you can see, I'm really good at doing straight cuts. <laughs> so this is my good stuff that I've been using. But like a Wally, as you can see, I don't know if you can see it, there, it's all white. And I think that's where it's all got the raw resin on it. What a plonker. So anyway, all I'm going to do now is put this lot in here and as i said i am not mixing up mate brands i am not mixing up like turbo to do with cascade or anything like that these are all all um normal cascade as you can see it's quite gloopy on the bottom They're uh, still coming. And if I get to the bottom and it won't come out, I'll just put it in a bit of warm water, like you would normally, and just let it gradually um, unsolidify, if that's the right word. Okay, let's have a go. Oops. Let's have a go. Oh, wow, look at that lot. Look. 
Wow, <laughs> there's loads there. So, I'm just gonna, I'm thinking, I'm, uh, how am I gonna do this so you can see? Can you see, if I go that way, hope you can see now, because I can't see what you're looking at. Oh, this is quite awkward. And if you do this, whenever you've finished your um, resin, you'll never waste any. Resin is so expensive. It's just, it's too expensive. Ugh, my fingers, I should have put gloves on. It's too expensive to just chuck away. I mean, I've got loads here now. Let's see if I can entice any more down. Excuse my belly growling at you. And then all you'd have to do to be able to use it is put it in a warm bath. Right. I can see loads on the bottom. My hand's not quite big enough to grab it. <laughs> you wonder how much you chuck away I know I've I've started wondering that how much do I actually throw away when I think the bottle is empty Still loads in here, but it's all like thick, thick stuff. I have now got that much. So I'm going to do exactly the same with part B, and I hope that saves you, makes you. Um, simple for you to understand you'd be a bit thick if you didn't that was a silly thing for me to say <laughs> um but yeah save your money maybe not your time but it saves money so i'm just going to take these little bits out of the top here don't know why i'm just playing but anyway i shall see you again soon Bye bye